Give me a new mission. Don't make me do some weird. Oh, you're gonna make me do some weird you shit. Go, you have to talk to Julius, and Julius will tell you to go calm down, Gil. Use you use if, Julius if on Gil. <laughs> <laughs> no, we have to use ourselves on Gil. Julius is using us on Gil. Oh, okay. We're doing his dirty work. He's the captain, but he's like, yeah, you do, person. Go deal with this, because I don't want to. He's all the way up in the garden, and I just got comfy. <laughs> there, I did it. I soothed Gil's aching heart. Oh, my God. <laughs> I didn't sign up to blood, Team Blood for this drama. I don't know if there was any signing up, but there was a needle and some screaming. Yeah, I thought we were going to be fighting monsters, not dealing with teen angst. I don't know if Gilfred's a teenager. Of course he is, it's an anime. He might be the older one though, he's taller and he has a deep voice. Yes, which means he's probably like 18. <laughs> I think Julius is like 20. Julius is clearly 14. Julius is not 14. <laughs> Don't, it's okay. That's legal in Japan. <laughs> How did you know? <laughs> My ulterior motive. <laughs> oh, whoops. I'm not holding a controller. <laughs> I forgot that we played this video game. What is all this noise? You said, let's play the new Monster Hunter. That was just announced at E3 2017 by Capcom. <laughs> and it's already out <laughs> in America and also in the UK. Well, we're really good at video games. I don't even know what these things are, and I don't want to. Which one? These are the ones that I'm eating. They're weird. I, I thought it might have turned the volume on the game up again, but it hasn't. It's still set to minimum. It's pretty loud. <laughs> Maybe it's like when my game just randomly kept getting quieter and then it took a screenshot and the volume came back. And then the CD tray opened. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm surprised it didn't. Yeah, your computer is definitely haunted. <laughs> I'm okay with that. You know that's what I've always wanted. That's true. So you are of the blood unit. Emil! <coughs> Impressive. Don't. Yet Emil is talking. Beyond the horizon, the Aragon. We're on a ship. You are undoubtedly gripped yeah. by fear. Yeah. I didn't know that. Take courage, friends. For oh, I saw it in the intro. Now that you mention it. Yeah, that's it. It was pretty cool. I shall stand firm and defend you. You shall know no fear whilst beside me. <laughs> Don't be shy, my friend. It is my sworn duty to help the weak. That is the truth of chivalry. Be not ashamed of your helplessness, weakness, impotence, for I am not ashamed of my impotence. <laughs> <laughs> I I just keep telling him to go away. <laughs> That's what I did. Of course. That was before he slowly grew on me. You do also get to punch him into the sky. Oh, yeah. That's him. Uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> Whoa, I can finally just do a mission without doing some goddamn hopscotch with somebody first. I don't believe that. I just walked up to the desk and it was just like, mission. <laughs> and I was like, oh, oh my god, good. thank you. I didn't want to have to bring Romeo his laundry. I had a code name on my other character. Her first name was Anime, and her last name is Funkadelic. Oh. <laughs> uh, so what does it show up as? Uh, her code name is just Funkadelic. So does Anime ever get said anywhere in the game? Sometimes, not very often. Like <laughs> Julius sent me an email about one of the characters we meet soon. And like in it, he had a quotation, something like, and it's all thanks to, and then it has your character name. So it says, it's all thanks to anime. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, yeah, <clears throat> yeah, everything is thanks to anime. <laughs> Am I pretty? No. Don't lie to me. Okay. Oh, look, Emil is my friend and you're stuck with Gilfred. Gilfred. <laughs> 
I don't know why I started calling him Gilfred, but I never stopped. I did. I had to look at him. <laughs> I was like, wait, is his name Gilfred? You'll see. When you watch this back, you'll see. I, I spanned the camera around to look at him when you said it. <laughs> <laughs> look, it's our first big monster. Help me kill. I don't know where it is. I'm still picking flowers. It's a oh, I see it. It's terrifying. Don't, I'm don't killing it. Yeah, 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 I'm Oops. fighting it. <laughs> I just shot a meal out of the sky like a beautiful missile. I killed it. No, it's still alive. Oh. Maybe this is a different monster. <laughs> oh, the there you? it is. <laughs> You've been fighting a baby monster, and all three of us have been fighting the big one. <laughs> He's gonna zap me real bad. Well, then use your freaking damn old shield. I gave you a kiss bullet. How do you do that? You have to eat, and then you have kick bullet, and then you can give them to your friend. No, I mean, how do you use a shield? <laughs> oh! Yeah, I've never done that before. Ow! He gave me a slap -o. That's rude. I thought so too. He got dead though. I really want to eat a brand of chips called Tastos because that's one of the dumbest names I've ever come up with. Uh. There's a there's an Irish brand of potato chips called Tatoes. That's pretty close. So, I don't care, Gil. I don't know if I want to watch the Tom and Jerry Willy Wonka movie, but I think I probably will. Don't. <laughs> your soul will go to hell. <laughs> You'll still be alive, but your soul will be in hell. Apparently, you know the guy in the original who's like. Bring me an everlasting gobstopper or something. <laughs> or something. <laughs> you know that yes. guy. And then it uh -huh. turns out at the end he actually works for Willy Wonka and it was all a test. Uh -huh. Apparently in the Tom and Jerry version, that guy, when he first meets Charlie, he, he sings Veruca Salt's song from later in the movie. Oh, of course. Which she also still sings later in the <laughs> movie. <laughs> And also, he keeps showing up through the whole factory trying to steal the Everlasting Gobstopper and, like, succeeds in stealing it. So, but, like, why? Because he, thought, it still turns out that he worked for Willy Wonka at the end. I thought they were doing a faithful recreation, but it, putting Tom and Jerry in there for no reason. Oh, oh, it's a monkey! What? Congo! Oh, behind me? Ah! <laughs> yeah, there he is. <laughs> We're fighting some of the, the real heavy hitters now. We got a Congo. We this is like a pipe organ monkey. Yeah. I'm into it. I hate him. I hate him and all of his friends and family. That's okay. Did you not bring any friends with us? Uh, Did I don't think you... Are not allowed to bring friends? Does it... Do you have to... I don't know, they've always just come with us before. I've never had the option. Am uh, I supposed to tell them to? I'm pretty sure you're supposed to bring friends with us. I brought you. I don't count. I'm not your friend, I'm your sister. Oh yeah. So, much like Monster Hunter, this is very much a game of stabbing things in the butt. Ow. Ah! Here's some, here's some ah. <laughs> you only got one of my kisses. Ow. I'm gonna die. Go damn cell. How? How do I do that? Uh, the, what is that button back? The back button brings up your inventory. Oh, Jesus, I gotta do inventory while I run around? You know, just like Monster Hunter. I know, I hate that though. <laughs> yeah, eat that syringe. Well, while you're over there putting syringes in your butt, I made the monkey fall down. I thought he was dead. No, he's not dead. He's a big monkey. Well, he's a boss monkey. Someone's voice said or origami down and I was like, aha, he's dead. That was the little one that I killed. I'm sorry, I didn't I didn't notice this. What's he doing? You never notice anything I do. That's not true. I noticed all those death threats she left on my bathroom mirror. Take my bullets! Alright now. Oh no! He belly flopped on me. He's getting dead. I'm eating some syringes. Cool. Tastes like a good. You shot me! Sorry. Is he dead? He died, but now there's another one coming. Oh. That's rude. 
I thought it was you.